guys, today we're telling you, what if we lost oxygen just for five seconds? Let's start. So, if we lost oxygen just for five seconds, it will have a huge impact on the Earth. As you know, oxygen is the most important element on Earth. It's what we breathe, and it's from trees. So if we lost oxygen for five seconds, the consequences will be bad. Trust me. In just five seconds, the Earth will look completely different. Actually, not how it's looking now. So if we lost oxygen just for five seconds, we will get sunburns immediately. Why? Because oxygen is pretty much the ozone layer. The ozone layer protects us from ultra UV rays, which is coming from the sun. Ow! Sun! Hey, sun! You should not make me get a sunburn. There. Gone. If we lost oxygen just for five seconds, we'll get some sunburns immediately because the ozone protects us from the sun UV rays. Okay. If we, well, well, if we lost oxygen for. By just five seconds, which is a so short time period, it'll still, the consequences will be bad. All the buildings will be falling down and that will not be good. This will cause earthquakes to come and it will cause the, it will cause the earth to open and that will cause earthquakes and anything pretty much even tornadoes dunna -na -na. Dunna -na -na. hurricanes will be sweeping the entire cities entire cities in that five seconds already after the five seconds most of this it will pretty much damage pretty much all the united states the hurricanes will be a 3.5 on the hurricane scale, which I don't exactly know what that is. Okay, yeah, a hurricane scale. And 3.5 is a lot, okay? For a hurricane. So... This will cause lots of devastation if we lost oxygen. Better, better hold your breath like you do in the swimming pool. The max a person has ever held in his breath was over 26 minutes. So, Five seconds will be easy, anyone, most people. But still, a building will be falling on them without even them noticing it. Huge tides and tsunamis will be breaking up, which will cause even more buildings, even made with concrete, to fall down. It will break any concrete construction pretty much. Then, when, 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 there's a lot more which will happen. Then, you know what? Maybe even a super dust storm might happen. You might have heard of this before. A super dust storm is dust getting into the air and filling up thousands, if not millions of feet. I mean, thousands, hundreds, if not thousands of feet up in the air. 
and the UV rays is one of the most important. Solar flares will be hitting the Earth, and that is not good. The only good thing is that you will see some auroras, beautiful auroras, up in the sky. And then those auroras will catch the attention of many people, and they won't even see that a building or a hurricane or a tsunami or trash talk is falling on them. Oh, it's not trash talk, okay, buddy. So, this will cause a wide range of money to get away. Which money? Dollars? Euros? Radios? Oreos? No, not all of them. Maybe Orioles will stay on the ground. Hey, Earth Oreo. So, well, there's much more. Yeah, there is. If we so, then the, pretty much earthquakes will be happening all over the world. Lots of natural devastation. Volcanoes will erupt. And do you know what that will cause? This. So that lifeless, that life, that ball which used to have so much life on it will completely be destroyed. So, then Christmas will not be there, okay, Christmas won't be there if the earth is hot as molten rock, so yeah. And that will be a harsh condition, which will not be good! What happened? Okay, good. We're still on Earth. We're not on Fireball Earth or something. So, the Earth will be a fireball, definitely. It will not be like a, it'll be a lifeless piece of rock. Hey, not this tiny rock. A big one. Means it's a lifeless earth, not a life more earth. Life more earth. So, if we lost oxygen for several seconds, which is five. Consequences will be at. Luckily, you won't be standing on fireball earth in the next five seconds. Okay? The ozone layer is still there over there. Can you see that blue thing over there? That's an ozone layer. And remember, if there is no ozone layer, no blue sky. And that means no blue sky. So bright. It will strain your eyes, definitely. And then flowers will, will not bloom, which will make it so bright. A tree will fall down if it's that bright. So yeah, guys, that's the video. Subscribe to our channel, press the notification bell, and don't be standing on Fireball Earth in the next five seconds, okay? Be safe. Goodbye. Hey, guys. Hey, guys. Bye-bye. Subscribe to our channel, press the notification bell, give a like, goodbye.